for the first time perhaps ever, I can honestly say Canadian politics is 10 times more interesting and exciting than anything going on in the U.S. Thankfully, 2024 is almost guaranteed to be the final full year in which the Liberals hold power over Canada. When it comes to scandals, however, one has to wonder if they can actually make it to October 2025. This year alone, Liberal scandals have included MPs helping foreign opponents, the Two Randy saga, Stephen Guibault's Green Slush Fund scandal, the $220,000 airplane food bill, well, now we just might have the scandal that actually stokes some much needed rage. Why would this scandal trigger us while the others didn't quite make the dent they should have? Because this scandal involves the military. The men and women who serve in the Canadian Armed Forces are quite likely the most patriotic among us, and part of them occupying their positions means they don't take things lying down. It's been revealed that former Defense Minister Harjit Sajjan abused of his position for the benefit of his own religious group after the Taliban retook control of Afghanistan. After the fall of Afghanistan, Canada estimated there were about 1,250 Canadian citizens that were left stranded. On that same notion, Conservative MP Alex Ruff, himself a Canadian Armed Forces veteran, was petitioning to have Afghans who helped Canadian forces get pulled from the country as well. Despite all this, Harjit specifically instructed the troops he presided over to focus first and foremost on rescuing Afghan Sikhs. No, not Canadian Sikhs living in Afghanistan, but Sikhs who happen to be Afghan nationals. Many across social media have made it very clear they consider this a gross violation of his responsibilities and a trust Canada placed in him as our defense minister. So far, Harjit has been quoted as responding to this fiasco with, I can only surmise that if I did not wear a turban, no one would question whether my actions were appropriate. Beautiful liberal race card. You gotta love it. Yes, we are recognized and respected the world over for our peacekeeping, but CAF troops have a sworn duty to protect Canadian interests first. To make matters worse, a group calling itself the World Sikh Organization is trying to paint Canadians as racists and xenophobe for being outraged over this screw job. With that said, will this outrage our troop that said, will this scandal outrage our troops enough for them to mount pressure? To mount a pressure campaign that'll see Harjit ejected from the Liberal caucus? Or the House of Commons, period. We all know the answer to that question. We can bring all the heat we want, but when you're dealing with a party that is incapable of feeling shame or guilt, it's pointless. The silver lining? Harjit's writing is now leading conservative in the polls, so he's a very likely casualty in the next election. As always, you're encouraged to sound off in the comments. Thank you for watching, and please consider subscribing.